What's up? This is GPS Indian Five Motorsports here, and welcome back to another Skyrim video. And yeah, this is part three of the Ethernautics mod, and uh, part something of my uh, Dawn Guard playthrough. Although that's kind of put off to the side for the moment, and we have to deal with this badass here. Uh, yep, deal with that, and you're dead, and freaking awesome. And I hope he doesn't fall off the walkway. That would be very bad. So, Ethereum, yep. Uh, 11 glass arrows. Grand Soul Gym. And that's about it. Okay, wow. I think we're getting very close to the end here. So, ooh. Do we have... We've got two of these guys to deal with, I think, in a very short span of time. Uh, you're dead, and you're dead. There we go. Iced. Pretty, uh, pretty cool. So down here, and then this one. Wow, this is a heck of a dungeon crawl. It doesn't matter if you attack me or not, because I'm going to friggin' blow you to smithereens. Two shine you with my gun. Okay, so, whoa, okay. Excellent. Platforming. We want to go the jumpy way or the not jumpy way. I guess we go the not jumpy way. Pretty simple here. Just gotta wait for these to do this. And then go. Release! Thank you. Oh, great. <sighs> okay, whoa. Okay, we're almost there. Just a couple more, just a few more. Oh, great. Excellent. So yeah, I'm gonna have to um I'm gonna have to cheat my way back there. That kinda sucks. I should have saved. Yeah, we're here. Where where are we? Where Hmm. So yeah. We are here in in this room way towards the beginning of the of the thing so yeah I'm just gonna have to uh, I'm just gonna have to cheat and get back there so yeah I hate to do this but you know gotta do what you gotta do huh uh, so yep uh, I guess I'll just uh, fast forward and we are back yep so um, I just had to sort of cheat my way here and while I'm at I might I may as well save like I should have done last time. Um, and yeah, so oh yeah, I got to turn God mode off too. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're going to navigate this puzzle here, and I have to level up. I keep remembering things. Um, so I leveled up my archery. I leveled up critical shot, and so yeah, save again. Why not? And then. Like that, so I'll just wait for this to. Okay, so do that, and then. Ah, oh, man, failed the jump. That sucks. But all is not lost. We have saved. So yeah, in case you haven't been able to tell. I am absolutely horrible at platforming in Skyrim. So yeah, go over there and then jump. Ah, whoa, whoa. Okay, that was a bit too close for comfort. Woo. Yeah, and then pretty easy, just like that. And then just three more, just three more. Come on, GP. You can do this. You can do this. One more. One more now. One more. Bring at me. What you got? I am a platforming god. Actually, I'm not. <laughs> but anyway. So. <laughs> uh, what else? What is this? What is this here? Do lolly. Open Rathama's launch pad. Oh, we are so close. Could this be it? 
It must be. Okay, so we've got levers. Mission control, we have levers. And what is this? Summon lift? I summoned it. Uh, lift down, yep. Lift down, why not? Click on the gear, whoa! Jeez. Uh, okay, so this lift is kind of rough. Jeez. They must have taken inspiration for this from the Mass Effect 1 ridiculously long um, elevator rides. <laughs> Whoa. Holy shit. Wow, look at that. Dude! Wow! I am awed by this. Okay, so yes. I get it, this elevator's rough. Can you just let us off now? Where's the pathway? Okay, screw this! I'm gonna jump down. It cost me a little bit of health, but whatever. Dude. Okay, so. What do we do here? What do we, what, what, what do you, what do we do, what do we do, what do we do? I hear things. That was safe. Um... Is that another elevator? I hope we don't have to go back to another freaking like control room or something. That would just suck. But it would be realistic. I'll have to give the mod that. Um, so what is this? What do we do here? Rathama's Ethereum Station. Hmm. Rathama's Ethereum Station. Uh, mm, uh, 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 um, okay, so lift down into lava. I'm going to save just in case this kills me. Yeah, new save, please. Thank you. No, it goes sideways. Er, 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 uh, dude, what in the world is this? I can't move through the center of the thing because of the friggin' lift handle deal. Also, who'd be suicidal enough to do this? Someone, apparently, was that suicidal. Okay, final sort of boss guy, I guess? Boss guys. I guess these guys are gonna take more damage. Oh, shh. I might just have to get my arrows of insta kill for this. I guess this guy is gonna be a freaking god of some sort. Lever. Okay, so what what did the lever do? Did that shit 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 that's not a good situation, I don't think. Whoa! Ah, that killed me. Didn't it? Yeah, it did. So that killed me. So I'm gonna have to get my friggin' arrows of vents to kill out. To friggin' ruin the damn boss fight. Ah, hate doing this, but... Frost, arrow of instant kill, damage 10,000. So that guy can't possibly have 10,000 health points. But yeah, the reason I'm doing this is quite simply the video must move on. 
I don't like just pausing and you know just retrying things and doing the same thing over and over and over and over and over again. That just sucks. So yeah, I'm gonna snipe this guy. I guess. Can I go ahead and do that right out of the gate? Nope, not yet. So I guess I have to get this at least this close to him. Yep, and then he's dead. And then his buddies are going to die. Before the centurion falls into the lava, you recklessly dive forward over about 20 or 30 yards. While the metal is white hot, your limited intelligence allows you to ignore it. <laughs> you even pull and manage to pluck the ethereum uh, fuel shard off of it before leaving, letting it fall back into the lava. So I guess that's important. So, a lever. That now does nothing. Excellent! What was this? A hallway. Around the side. What does this do? Does this go back around here? The thumb is launch pad. Hmm. Okay. So, here we are. Back at the Rathama's launch pad, and I guess we have to um, do things here that, you know, got put the uh, la the fuel thingy back in the Doolalian stuff. Is that the angle at which we came at uh, came at before? Uh, we've got this thing here. Kind of pointless, I think. Yeah, this is where we came at before. So, any uh, any exits here? We've got the Thumbas Ethereum Station. Uh, yeah, those are the only two exits we've uncovered so far. Hmm. So, what is this? Earth, um, Nava's uh, engineering core. Okay, whatever this is. If this is the ship itself, I'm just going to call it the Normandy. Wow. So, yes, here we are. This must be the Normandy. Uh, what's this? Is this uh, the drive core? It looks an awful lot like it. Yes, this is in fact the drive core, so... Ethereal engine control. Can't activate it yet, I don't guess. Wow. We really need Tally here. Chronographer. Uh, things. Uh, okay, so I guess you knew how to do this. Hmm. Yeah, that must be Engineer Donnelly. Who killed Donnelly, you bastards? Okay, so we got something, a book, or some sort, I don't know. Uh, and we can't go that way. Excellent. So, to the other side of the Normandy with us, then. Well, what's... Is there anything down here? No, it's just a ramp. And I guess I'm stuck now. Yeah, I am, in fact, stuck. Congratulations, GP. Fail of the year. Okay, maybe I can get... Get, get up there, get up there. Yes, okay. Whew. I thought I was going to have to cheat. And then, uh, just another pointless ramp downwards here, and things do things. And, uh, this part. What's this? What is this? We've got a whole bunch of chests here. Um, and a door? No, not a door. Hmm. 
just a whole bunch of chests. I guess that would be uh, our equivalent of the shuttle bay, maybe. And Sentry Ad Crime. That was the guy who. Oh, Ethereum f Fuel Shard. We need that. We're going to need that. Uh, I think we need to uh, go back to the drive core now. So try it now. Because it looked like half of a some sort of thing, some sort of mechanism. And it looks like this is the place where we would put that mechanism. Now, I guess we gotta have more... Um, I'm not sure. Hmm. So I guess to the other end? Of the Normandy? I wonder if Joker's still alive, because everybody else here is dead. That would suck if he wasn't. So... The bridge. Yes. I guess this would be the combat the combat information center or something. Uh lever this uh Okay, up here, I guess. Nope. I thought that would lead somewhere cuz I know here's got to be like the CIC, the you know, Joker's cockpit whatever. Yep, here's uh, Joker's place. Joker, you okay? He's turned into an arquebus. Excellent. Fuel shards. Launch sequence activator. Oh, here we go. Did that? I don't think that did anything. Did? Mm. Yeah, Joker's turned into a bunch of stuff. That's good. Yay. An ethereal archivus. Okay. That does even more stupid amounts of damage, so I'm just going to um, drop that. Get rid of it. And get that. How? What? How am I encumbered? Drop that. And I'm still, jeez, encumbered by five pounds. That must have been freaking massive. Okay, and then I uh, get rid of, hmm, what to get rid of? An elven helmet, uh, if th only there's a way to sort by... Okay, uh, Iron Helmet. Those are common. I guess I'll just get rid of the Iron Dovahkiin Helmet. Even though I don't like to. And I'm still encumbered. What in the world? Okay, so I'll just drink uh, a potion of... Lasting potency, I guess. And I'm no longer encumbered. Yay! So... What's down here? Is this is this the CIC? It must be. A button, and levers, and another button, and more levers, and stuff, and things, and what's this? Uh, a valve, and button, a button. Lever, uh, da, 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 da. what have you, the SSV Normandy point five. Yeah, so this is definitely the CIC. Um, so, like here would be where I stand to, uh, you know, for the um, galaxy map to open up. This is all very Mass Effect-y. Then again, I'm a big Mass Effect nerd, so anything remotely sci-fi is Mass Effect-y. And I've got a thing in my upper right-hand corner of my screen. There's two tilts, an upwards-pointing arrow, and a bar. 
a captain's chair. Sweet. So all the cameras just really fast. <laughs> hmm. So this was an entirely pointless trip. Navs bridge. And what else? What else do we have? Uh engineering core. I have to go back down to the engineering core. Um so run over here. Uh do we is this what I I guess this is where we put the um fuel things okay it is she's starting one more I think she's starting up so I guess we just have to go back to the bridge Go back to Joker's chair. We are so close to having a spaceship right now, it's not even funny. Well, actually, it is kind of funny because this is Skyrim, but you get what I'm saying. Just gotta go back to the bridge. Just gotta get back to the bridge. I'm safe here in case something happens. And then, this is so close. We are, I think, uh, I think, I think we are incredibly close to having a frigging spaceship. Here we go. Countdown. Holy shit. Here we go. This is it. Dude. Wow. I'm stunned. My game is... Okay, there we go. Jesus. That was friggin' cool. Yeah. Holy cow, man. <sighs> okay, so yeah. We've got a couple of other parts of this ship to explore. I think we do at least. Um, we've got what the... So what is this? These doors here functioning oh yeah the captain's freaking quarters awesome dude freaking ethernautics a freaking spaceship a spaceship in Skyrim and here we are shepherd's quarters what would be shepherd's quarters yes this is basically a blatant ripoff of Shepherd's Course from, <laughs> from Mass Effect. Wow! This is plagiarism. But it's cool. Uh, boom! There's another screenshot from Mass Effect if you want to compare the two. Uh, this right over here. Okay, this is where all your, like, spaceship, you know, your, um, uh, your, uh, your, um, die cast models of, um, spaceships that you buy it like the sil the citadel and you know stuff goes and this is uh this would be a personal terminal um and this would be another one and right there somewhere would be a button where um uh you can at points call various crew not crew members up to the cabin i think uh is how uh shepherd calls tell you up to the cabin uh, to catch up in, you know, the first few hours of ME3, so yeah, my own personal stone bed, very comfortable, uh, a chest, uh, another chest with stuff, apparently, 
Yep. That's cool. And, uh... What's really missing here is a music box. I mean, I really need a music box. And here's the aquarium. I hereby dub the ship the Na the uh, SSV Normandy SR.5. There we go. And I don't think this is here in Mass Effect. But yeah. So yeah. The SSV Normandy SR.5. And if I'm not mistaken, I do think we have got a spell that allows us to call... Uh, an orbital strike down. Um, um, well, there's, I don't think it's going, I don't think it's in my, uh, inventory. Hmm. Nope, it doesn't look like it's in my inventory yet, but yeah, but yeah, so you can uh call down frigging orbital strikes from the Normandy. Maybe it's a shout. Um Ice Form Kind's Peace. Hmm. Well, I don't know. I think I should have gotten it. I think I should have gotten one, though. A shouter magical spell of some sort, but anyway, so yeah! Dude! I now have my own spaceship in Skyrim. Yes. It's freaking amazing. Oh, the docking bay. What does this lead to here? The weapon systems. Sweet. So yeah, this is... I hope we get through with the exploration of this damn thing in... in some time. Because <laughs> this is officially a very long video, and very big too. So what is this? The uh, weapon systems core. Awesome. That, look, that does look a lot like uh, a biotic field from Mass Effect. So yeah, I mean, uh, that does look like a, a Mass Effect field. Okay, so what is this? What, what do we have here? What is this? What does this go up to? Uh, there's a thing there, and uh, this goes up here. And whoa! Dude! Okay, and this goes... It's a door, and it's a... a n n and Normandy. It j I'll just call it the Normandy whenever I see that name. And, whoa. That's the airlock. A couple more minutes. A couple more minutes. Oof. So, yeah. A little bit too close to death for comfort. Mmm. <clears throat> So, just down here, I guess, and then down again. Roommate, roommates. Roommates again, man. So, just one more uh, area to explore the docking bay. Yeah. Here we go. The docking bay. Now arriving at docking bay D24. What's this? This is stuff and uh... Okay. Can't... This is small. Hmm. Pretty cool. I have to admit, I don't know what this is. Um... Yeah, this was the shuttle bay for uh... You know, where you... Uh, where you saw the Mako in Mass Effect, uh, Mass Effect 3. And you could see the shuttle bay, um, in Mass Effect 2 as well. So, yeah. Freaking spaceship, the Normandy in Skyrim. <laughs> Dude. I don't think I have to tell you how amazing that is. I'm gonna save here, and, um... 
I might as well try to find a way out, for one thing, because I don't know how to get out of here. Um, but yeah, so I guess I'll do that in another video. Or actually, no, I'll just do it here. Right now, I think I know the way out. Um, could be through engineering, maybe. The door. Is this it? Nope, that's not it. Hmm. I have no idea how to get back out of here. This this sucks. <laughs> I have no clue how to get out of this thing here. So I guess I'll just have to COC you, White Run, I guess. Yeah, so I... Yeah, I'll, I guess I'll try to find a way out of here between videos. So yeah, until then, I'll see you guys in the next video. Uh, when we resume freaking Dawn Guard. So yeah, see you guys then. GP75 out.